Hey everyone, this is Sarah from System Dynamics, and today I want to share with you the benefits of creating and running an online community as a real estate agent or mortgage professional. Platforms like Facebook and Twitter come equipped with online community functions. Facebook calls theirs groups, while Twitter calls them communities. These platforms allow users to create and manage their own online group of people with similar interests. In this video, I want to go over the two major ways you can utilize Facebook groups or Twitter communities to grow your business. The first way you can start to optimize online communities is to join pre-existing communities or groups. Facebook and Twitter groups provide unique opportunities to connect with potential clients in a targeted way. By joining groups that are related to your niche or specific geographic area, you can engage with people who are already interested in your services. For example, do you specialize in new home buyers? Look for a new home buyer community on Facebook or Twitter and join it. Engaging in these groups can help you build relationships, establish trust, and ultimately lead to more business. In order for this to work, you have to engage with the community. Answer questions posed by members of the group, post about new listings or important resources. Joining an online community just to linger isn't going to get your name in front of prospective clients. I cannot stress enough the importance of engaging in these online communities that you join. Joining a pre-existing community can also help you network with other professionals in your industry. By joining groups that are relevant to your niche, you can connect with other real estate agents, mortgage brokers, home inspectors, and so many more people. These relationships can lead to future collaborations, referrals, and business opportunities. Real estate is a constantly evolving industry, and it's important to stay up to date with the latest news and trends. By joining relevant Facebook groups, you can get access to insights and information from other real estate professionals. This can help you stay ahead of the curve, make informed decisions, and provide a better service to your clients. The second way to utilize online communities is to create one yourself. This is a good option if you already have an established client base. Inviting past clients to a group and providing them with content that is useful to them will promote brand loyalty. The more loyal a client is to your brand, the more likely they are to refer you to their friends or family. Members of your group can ask you questions, share their experiences, and even offer feedback. And as a real estate or a mortgage professional, this is a great opportunity for you to build lasting relationships with potential clients and establish yourself as a thought leader in your industry. Running a Facebook or Twitter group can provide valuable insights into what your audience is looking for. By paying attention to the conversations and questions within your group, you can gain a better understanding of your audience's pain points and preferences. You can run polls or surveys and learn about your target audience directly from the source. This information can help you tailor your services and content to better meet the needs of your target audience. Let's recap. Building a community on social media takes time and effort, but it is so worth it. Online communities are an excellent way for real estate agents to connect with potential clients, stay up to date on industry news and trends, build relationships with other industry professionals, showcase their expertise, and engage in cost-effective marketing. It is completely free to either run or join Facebook and Twitter groups. So you are marketing without spending a dime. These platforms are free to use and free to market on. You don't have to pay for Facebook or Twitter ads in order to take advantage of the marketing opportunities on those platforms. Creating and running a Facebook or Twitter group can provide so many benefits, including a targeted audience, increased engagement, valuable insights, networking opportunities, and increased brand awareness. By defining your audience, being consistent, providing value, engage, and engaging with other accounts, you can create a community that not only supports your business, but helps you grow as a professional. If you're not already taking advantage of this social media tool, now is the time to start. That's all I have for today's video. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below, and be sure to subscribe to System Dynamics for more great tips and tricks like in this video. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.